this video we're going to introduce another way to delete elements from a list using the DEL or delete statement which is not only capable of deleting from a list but also capable of deleting variables from an interactive Python session as well so we'll demonstrate those cases to you now for the purpose of this example we'll once again work with a list of numbers uh, for this one let's say we want to produce the range of values uh, 0 through 9 and of course if we go ahead and evaluate numbers we can see the contents of that list now the DEL statement can be used to remove from a list any valid index position or any subset slice that you specify so for example if I go ahead and say DEL uh, numbers sub minus one that says delete the last element of the list and if I now go and reevaluate numbers we can see there's one fewer elements in the list the nine has been removed now like I said you can also delete slices so if I say uh, delete numbers sub 0 colon 2 and again 0 in this case is implicit because it's the start of the list so I could just say DEL numbers colon 2 in the square brackets uh, and in this case we can go ahead and take a look at numbers and see that the first two elements the slice from 0 up to but not including index position 2 has been removed from the beginning of the list now as you might expect you don't have to delete consecutive elements in a slice because any valid slice can be used so if I now go ahead and say let's delete from numbers every other remaining element that's going to start from index 0 which will be inferred as the first index go all the way through the list so the length of the list will be inferred as the second index and every other element will be removed so we'll delete the 2, 4, 6, and 8 from the remaining list and if we now go ahead and evaluate numbers we see that only 3, 5, and 7 are remaining and as you would also probably expect now based on what we've shown you with slices we could even do delete numbers colon in square brackets which just says delete all the elements of the list numbers and now it is an empty list so uh, as I mentioned towards the beginning of this video in addition to being able to delete elements from a list which is a mutable object so you can't do this for slices or strings for example but in, in addition to modifying lists you can also delete variables from the current session as well so if I simply say delete numbers that literally says remove the variable numbers from this interactive IPython session so now if I try to evaluate numbers it tells me that that name is not defined here in the current session.